As of today, law enforcement has been hunting for Lloyd for five days nonstop. But despite that, Police Chief John Mina says they are not even close to giving up. News 6 reporter Nadine Giannis joins us now live from outside OPD headquarters. And Nadine, you talked with Chief Mina just moments after Sergeant Clayton's body passed by being transported to the, cert to the church for her funeral tomorrow. I did, Lisa. And you know, Chief Mina has always been very professional, very composed. But today when I spoke to him, you could tell that he was hurting for his officers as they lined up as Master Sergeant Deborah Clayton's processional came by the Orlando Police Department today. Let's take a look at some of that video. Now, even though the helicopters were hovering above and the motorcycles were passing by, it was still silent as uh, Sergeant Clayton's processional came by OPD. Her brothers and sisters in blue saluted to pay tribute to the 17 years she worked to keep us safe. But what makes this point harder for these officers is knowing that her killer is still out there. On day five of the manhunt for Mayor Keith, News 6 has learned that the search is now expanding into Polk County. Haines City Police putting out an alert that he may be in town since he may have family there. Chief Mina wouldn't confirm exactly where they're looking uh, in the search today, but he says the way that they're going to honor Sergeant Clayton and fallen Deputy Norm Lewis this weekend is by pushing through whatever motion that they may have to make sure they're still fighting to keep Lloyd in jail. And today I asked Chief Mina that question. I asked that his officers must be so exhausted mentally, physically, and emotionally, especially ahead of these two funerals planned for this weekend. I asked him what he plans to do about that. We're gonna hear more about how they're working through it and continue to find Lloyd and my story at five o'clock. Ladies. All right, Nadine Giannis reporting live for us. Thank you.